Hello, hello YouTube. Chastex Barkus and another great tutorial. And today's tutorial is about how to fix an entry point not found or the procedure entry point cannot be located, which is due to in the dynamic link library. So if you are facing this problem on your Windows computer, so this video will have a solution for you. So stay tuned until the end of the video. So to solve this problem, the solution that this video will recommend you is download the Visual C++ Redistributable Package. So in order to download this, open your browser, Google Chrome or Microsoft AOA. So after the browser, open type on the search box Visual C++. You type Visual C++, you will find Visual C++ Redistributable for Visual Studio. 2013 or 2013 so open that and it will lead you to here the first option microsoft.com which is the software you'll find here so select that down and you will find here an option so you can select language here by clicking the arrow to select the language that you want and click here download then you will find here different bits 64 86 different bits so in order to check your beat just click here the search icon before you download and type here system information so here the system information then open it and on the system information you will find system type which is in my case it's 64 bit so close this and select here 64 bits so in my case it's 64 then as you can see here the total size is 6.9 megabyte and i'm going to click next so it will proceed to download here it's downloading so based on the speed of the internet it may slow or will be fast so here the download completed just then click, click here and click here show in folder or you can run it right there so here the app so i'm going to right click on it and select here run as administrator then confirm it select yes and it will ask you a confirmation to install so select here i agree and click here install so here microsoft visual c 2013 setup successful so close this and close this one and open the cmd type here cmd then right click on it and select run as administrator and confirm here by selecting yes and type here sfc space slash scan now it's going to check if there will be any error so here sfc scan now then press enter so it will start system verification wait until the system verification process will be completed until it will be 100 percent and that and after the system uh, scanning completed then restart your computer here the verification completed 100 percent in windows resource protection did not find an integrity value in case you may find some errors so just close your command prompt and restart your computer so this are the solution to solve the entry point not found in dynamic link library in windows computer so if, if this video is helpful please like subscribe and share to your friends thank you for watching